Michael? Huh? Good. Good, good, good. Good. Turn yeah, out good. You look taller on the videos. What's that? You look taller on the videos. Oh yeah? <laughs> <laughs> you from around here? Yeah, I'm from Chicago. I watch your videos all the time too. Oh man, I appreciate it. Do you, you order do you order that, yeah. huh? Look at this guy. I also had two pictures that you guys look at this. We got fans here. They bought the shirt. Okay, yeah, looks like a nice truck. Thank you. Yeah. Appreciate it, man. Get a picture too, man? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll take a hat if that's an option. Yes, you can awesome. get a hat, but shirts, too. Yeah, oh, we got you. Get a medium. Right. Mm -hmm. Can you do this for yourself? Medium, uh, medium. Please. So there's XL, small, medium. Medium. Can I get a picture with you real quick? Yep, no problem. Awesome, awesome. Perfect, thank you. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Yes, yes. All right, guys, we just wrapped up the meet and greet. Now we are gonna get a little tour of this place. Big, big place. You ready? Yeah. Okay. As far as sales floor, uh, we have parts, uh, parts department, service department, mm -hmm. um, and, and then eventually the checkout. Yeah. So uh, Elgin's our newest store, of course. Um, when did this open up, you know? When? We've been open about a year and a half. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, we've tried to keep our uh, our mega wall. We call it yeah. mega wall. It's, mm -hmm. it's a metal slat wall that we can hang our power equipment on and move the uh, displays throughout the season. Mm -hmm. So it's not you know unique to one brand. It's 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 kind of co-branded. But we can move in in the fall season. We can have a lot of blowers, and then uh, as the seasons change, we can switch it switch out, it out. relatively okay. easy. Same thing for our floor space. If you've noticed, nothing's. Uh, you know, really higher than four, four feet, five feet tall. Mm -hmm. kind of, you know, clear span. You can see the showroom very well, and we can move that, move those displays very easy again based on our different seasons. If it's fall, if it's winter, um, you know, very easy, very okay. portable, mobile. Just a matter of moving some equipment around. About how many square feet do you think this building is? This building is 125,000 square feet. Okay, wow. And this. This used to be a Walmart. This was a Walmart. Walmart. Yeah, this was a Walmart. And w when we bought the building, um, actually the ceiling was probably about 12 feet high. Okay. We we removed the the, the grid or the ceiling. Yeah. You know all the all the sprinkler pipe, all the duct work. We've changed everything. When all LED lighting, we raised the okay. ceiling. We pulled up the tile, did the epoxy floor. It just it just it's what yeah. works well. For us, we've had some experience, similar experience in our other stores as we've done the build out. Mm -hmm. We've repurposed pretty much all the buildings that we've uh, moved into and it, it just worked out well. Okay. So. You guys have service, you service too, as we, well. Yeah, all of our stores service. Um, we service trailers, we service all the equipment we sell. Uh, mm -hmm. We service brands that we don't sell. Um, so it's a big part of you know, wow. what we have going on. Right. So. And suppose this used to be the Walmart, uh, like the. This was, their, this was actually their uh, their garden center. Garden center. Okay. Yeah. 
Yeah, we've, we've converted this into our service area. Okay. Nice. So this is equipment that is okay. being serviced, or it's, or it's staged to be serviced, but it'll make its way in here eventually. Okay. It'll get serviced, and then either picked up or delivered to our customer. Okay. Mm -hmm. Compact utility equipment is very popular. Um, you know, the Avance or, mm -hmm. or Toro Dingles, things like that, are just... Um, okay. You know, labor is, a, is, is something that's more and more difficult to come by, so... Right. Uh, laborers, I should say, so... Any equipment that can help uh, streamline that, that production is, is just been something that's more popular. Okay. So we're seeing more of it from the service side as well. It's ready to be uh, either picked up or delivered. Okay. Hello? <laughs> parts receiving. Okay. So as parts come in, they get received and they'll get stocked. Boy. In a parts room. The shelving, okay. we have, we learned after our first store that uh, you need to actually learn the areas that you're in and the types of equipment and parts that are needed. Mm -hmm. um, so right out of the gate, we'll, we'll, we'll put a, you know, kind of a suggested uh, stock parts or standard parts based on our sales history through our, mm -hmm. through our system. Okay. And then, uh, but as we learn what type of equipment's in that, in that general area, what we're gonna s sell more of, okay. we'll go ahead and continue to build out that parts inventory. But in advance, we'll build, we'll have the shelving and the space ready to accommodate those additional parts that we'll bring in. Okay. So I would say one of our successes has just been, we've diversified significantly, right? We do a lot of soft goods. We do, um, you know, fertilizer, chemicals, uh, grass seed. Mm -hmm. uh, in the winter time, we do a lot of de-icing. Okay. So, um, you know, the, the winter business for us is a significant part of our business. Right. So in addition to plows and snow blowers, and parts, uh, de-icing is a, a big okay. part of that as well, bulk, bulk de-icing too. So then all these, like, is your brand. Yeah. You got them all resource. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we've, uh, nice. our marketing department's done a good job. That's there. nice. I know. I noticed those things, yeah. like that's, yeah. Yeah. that's awesome. We've done a good job at, you know, yeah. some, some tools, they'll come back here, they'll grab the items that they need, put it in the staging area, assemble it, bring it to mm -hmm. the showroom, and again, set it up either for delivery a lot of our business is delivered, okay. uh, or if it's being picked up, to put it in a, in a you know area for pickup or just on our showroom. Mm -hmm. so. You know, we see changes happening, and, and mm -hmm. you know they realize they need to be more efficient. Right. And that that you know that's not just their crew and the work that they do, but it's also how they purchase, what they purchase, mm -hmm. and uh, the service that that backs that up. Okay. So. And these are uh, just the brand new mowers in the crates. Yes. Our, our main facility is uh, near O'Hare it's sh in Chilla Park. Okay. Uh, that facility, square footage-wise, is a little smaller, but it's uh, a larger overall property. And uh, we do warehouse probably the majority of you know the bulk of our equipment there. Mm -hmm. So what you see at, at the individual stores is really for that store's needs. Okay. So these are sales that'll be made hopefully in the next you know 30, 60, 90 right. days. And then as we need you know, additional material here uh, or, or equipment, we'll either transfer it or the manufacturers will ship it directly here. Okay. One of the areas that we've been able to just kind of capitalize on our, uh, the, the larger space that just, we're just more efficient with our, op our operation as well. Mm -hmm. Anything from our, um, our pack packaging material from all the products that we bring in, crate, crates and liquids and uh, cardboard, we bale everything, everything gets recycled. Okay. Just uh, from, from a time perspective and just from doing the, the right thing, we're able to handle a lot of that, a lot of that um, garbage and right. material that comes off the packages. So we just entered an area that uh, is a lot of our online fulfillment. Okay, So this nice. space is treated a little bit different. There's separate employees that operate back here. Mm -hmm. and, um, and there's some products that are uh, unique to those individual those individual stores that will okay. ship more heavily out of the, each of those stores but okay uh, so that's pretty much what this space back here is 
You got trailers in here too, huh? Man. Trailers, I think we have four brands of four brands of trailers we sell. Okay. So this place a uh, contractor, lawn care landscaping guys can just come in here and find what they want. Yeah. Anything. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Most most of our um, most of the contractors in the area mm -hmm. are contractors we worked with for many years. Okay. We form relationships with them. We've seen a lot of their growth over mm -hmm. the years, and as they've moved out to different parts um, of, uh, of our general market, the different stores have really assisted in, in working with them right. at that local level, because they've opened satellites. Yeah. Windshield time doesn't make the money, so mm -hmm. they've moved, um, you know, expanded to different uh, satellite locations, right. and we're able to service them across the okay. board. Yeah. Okay. What makes this place unique? Selection is a, is a big thing, right? Yeah, Selection. I mean, I think that we have multiple locations that offers uh, service parts. Right. I mean, it's just the, the amount of inventory we have and the okay. ability to uh, connect with the customer on, on that level and mm -hmm. um, go, I mean, the amount of staff we have to go out okay. and do demos and, you mm -hmm. know, we do, do special um, events for seminars okay. and just kind of bring back to the industry some of the knowledge and mm -hmm. things that are going on. Um, just educating ourselves as well as our our customers that we're partnering with in a sense. Okay. So um, yeah. yeah, we just okay. yeah. so yeah. I mean this this is this is like my our first time being here. Okay. Yeah. And to me, it's it's literally like I can come in here and the service is great. Mm -hmm. I can come in here and find what I want, mm -hmm. and it's it's just the variety mm -hmm. variety of equipment inventory you talked about. And you know, if I wanted to get some fix right there, while yeah. I'm getting some fix, I need a power tool. Yeah. I'll buy one, grab yeah. one. So that's the neat part about this is that yeah. you know I can definitely get what I need and want. Yeah. So yeah. you guys, you guys got a great, great spot here. Yeah, definitely. We try to accomplish that. Again, uh, I would say what sets what sets us apart a little bit is the fact that. Uh, we've diversified with the products that we handle and, and understand our customers' needs mm -hmm. without getting too far, uh, right. you know, outside the industry. And, and uh, if it's if it's the fertilizer they need, parts, service, mm -hmm. uh, inventory is important. Understanding what they need mm -hmm. and uh, and being able to there to you know support them and right. partner with them. Okay. So that's. Okay. Yeah. Solutions in Rochester, Minnesota, guys. Hey, hey guys. Morning. Good, good, good. Oh, man. It is probably, getting, probably a long week for you, huh? Yeah, it's been long. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely. How about you there? Yeah. How's it going? Today I went to work yesterday here, and boy, I was dragging all day. Yeah, we ran a couple nights without sleep, you know. <laughs> But did you guys go out that uh what was it? Yeah, we started at three in the morning the day it started yeah. and ran all the way till almost three in the morning two days later. It took us for a long oh, time. Man. Then I suppose same thing. The wind yeah. of where we're from just killed yeah. us, you know, but that's mad it's just as bad where you're at. Yeah, so I you know, here. Here's a three X
the new models you get, the zero keys. Oh, that nice. is. Yep, yeah. you get a little more traction. Yeah. Don't I, shouldn't, shouldn't I get upgraded on these? Oh, you can. Hey, nice to meet you, man. See you guys on, on YouTube. Your His name's Juan, too. Juan? <laughs> yeah. He helps me during the winter. Just you guys do, do snow, too, then? A little bit. Okay. Yeah, I just got my plow truck this year, so. Okay, awesome. So we do like 10 or 15 right now. Mm -hmm. but I was just telling him it feels weird because we watch, I watch your videos every day. Yeah. And I'm like, oh my god, there's this truck, and you, know, <laughs> you guys stand there together. Right so yeah. I was all excited. But. Awesome. How long you been following them? Um, it's probably like a year and a half. Okay. Yeah, I started, I started watching um, Top Notch, mm -hmm. and then I found you. Mm -hmm. At first, when I, I remember when I first started watching your videos, I thought that you worked for somebody. I didn't right. realize that you own your own company, okay. and then I was like, hey, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah, and then you know. Huh. Yeah, and then I watched B and B too. Okay. That's pretty much all. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.